Good afternoon, Agandhi, and welcome to the inaugural episode of Big Beyond News. We're coming to you live on an exciting day in Rabugli. The locals are gathering, the canapes are made, and the banners are hung. Today is the Trees for Life event, a show of appreciation dedicated to the hard-working team at Rabugli Health Centre. Let's take a look around. If we can take a moment without getting in his way, I'd like to introduce Yoris, our Belgian import, overseeing the catering team here at Gorilla Custodian. How's today going, Yoris? Today is going so far so good. So we've got bruschetta with the locally produced mushrooms. We've got the locally produced uh, passion fruits filled up with the locally produced bananas and jam made of the locally produced eggplant. And furthermore, pancakes from the locally produced eggs and guacamole from the locally produced avocados. So it's a pretty local buffet this time. Louise, could you talk us through what today is all about? Well, yes, well, I will tell you what today is all about. Today is about celebrating trees, celebrating conservation as well as health. And this particular little soiree is for all the sort of dignitaries, speakers, friends of Big Beyond who have come together to, to build this event. So you'll see here people from Ua, the local headmistress here, was here, and um, also um, and some, and people from Tribal Vision whose venue this is, this fantastic venue. So that's why we're here today. <laughs> I'm here today to attend the tree planting uh, organized by Big Beyond. So, and it will be done at our health unit, Rubuguri Health Center 4. So, I'm looking forward to that event. It is a very big event to promote awareness for the green world and to avoid global warming and the effects of climate change. So, this is Amy, director and founder of Big Beyond. Amy, how does it make you feel to see your volunteers drawing the community together like this? It feels amazing. <laughs> it feels amazing to um, see Louise particularly in her element. And I love the fact that she's come from 20 years in London, a hectic corporate world, and brought those skills to the conservation work we're trying to do here. So for me, the whole, the whole fusion of those different skills and the goals of what we're doing on the ground is amazing. Um, and I love the fact that everyone's working together and um, bringing together the hospitality skills, the event skills, conservation skills, um, and business skills, and have all come together for today. So really cool, looking forward to it. Introducing the children of the Sunbeam Project, who will be dancing for us later on. Agandhi, everybody. Conservation is so important because uh, 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 originally we used it to depend on the forest. And uh, when it was gazetted into a national park, people have started realizing the importance of conservation because without the environment conserved, no good life, no rain, no good weather. So the Green Dreams reception has been a success and now we're leading the procession through to the health center and the Trees for Life celebration. We are at the start of the Trees for Life ceremony proper. Our very own Master of Ceremonies Justice has made the introductions, the music is playing, the crowds are thronging. Let's go and take a look around, shall we?
nine. So if it's all the same to you, Mujenda J, Big Beyonders, Bonga. Ah, gorgeous.